Last but not least on the financial donations tab, we're going to take a look at the donations by fund ID. This is tab number five. As we take a look at donations by fund ID, we can get donation reports by users followed by their fund ID. So let's say we want to take a look at the beginning of the year, January 1st, and we're going to end that February 5th, let's say. So we're going to select the user. We're going to select just a few, see if they've given anything. Okay. Actually, we're going to expand that a little bit. Let's, let's put May. And then instead of all 16, let's unselect that. And let's just put a few of the main ones. select get data on screen and now you can see the totals now if we want to add this we can say select all get data and now what you're going to see are and we have quite a few as you can see we have a quite a few fund ids and then you can export it to pdf or export it to excel so we're going to uncheck this and then we're going to select some of the main ones general missions okay things that we see all right and let's see special projects and let's try that again get data on screen now here you can see the total so let's say you want to select all your users and you want to run the same report with the seven fund ids for all the users okay so we're going to select get data on screen and here's the report that you see Okay, so you see everyone's name here that has given or has made payment. And then you start seeing the totals. This is what he has given Hugo to community development. Zero from the 1st of January through the 14th of May. But then he's given a total of $40 to this general fund ID. $3,632 to Ofrenda General and then $150 to Retiro de Hombres and $150 to Special Projects. So this allows you to see totals. And this is very important. Sometimes you may just need to look at totals and totals is what you need. You don't need to look at a lot of other details. So this is the report. And again, as always, you can export this report to PDF and to Excel. So first, select the start date of your report, the end date of your report, the user or the users or those you want to appear in the report the fund id it can be all of them or it can be seven or it can be just one get date on the screen and then you will get the totals per fund id per individual